chemotherapy per se as I told you is the administration of anti-cancer drugs intravenously most of the times and this uh, chemotherapy is given for almost all type of cancers including solid tumors and liquid cancers like leukemias, lymphomas. So, regarding the types of chemotherapy as I said uh, the drugs could be three way administered. It is not the question of administration, but it is the question of what you call different type of molecules. This is what is meant by the types of chemotherapy. The molecules can be in the form of uh, antibiotics or anti-metabolites, the age old uh, traditional drugs. Of late we have also called got what is called uh, molecular genetics and uh, the micromolecules are targeted here, where the, in the target therapy the biological factors intracellular or within the cancer cell which affect the progress of the disease are targeted either they are blocked or the particles which encourage and support the cancer cell growth are mimicked this is called agonist. So, the conventional chemotherapy apart like uh, anti cancer antibiotics metabolites we have also called what you call monoclonal antibodies these biological molecules are nothing but monoclonal antibodies, antibodies develop against particular antigens expressed on the cell membrane of the cancer cell. And uh, in the progress of this also evolve what is called TKI molecules, these are all mainly oral, while the monoclonal antibodies that is MAPs which are about 98 percent of the times used in cancer therapy are all intravenous preparations and uh, in certain situations they are also used in non malignant conditions. So, chemotherapy is also used in non malignant conditions sometimes like rheumatoid arthritis and other diseases wherein <coughs> not only oral form of chemotherapy, but also injectable monoclonal antibodies are given the latest example being what is called ulcerative colitis. So, chemotherapy as a form of treatment in the majority of the situations is for cancer. In a minor setup, it is also used in non malignant conditions as I have enumerated. So, this is in brief about the introduction for chemotherapy.